Welcome everyone, Cliff from Advanced Diagnostics. I really like this message that has been added to the Smart Pro in regards to the Acura Honda proc system. So let's talk about it a bit because it is an advantage that you're able to put a little bit more detailed text message on this third generation programmer known as the Smart Pro. Now I am bringing this out into the open because it's not something you're going to see reflected on the MVP T Code Pro for the simple fact that it is hard at this juncture to change the text or add text to the screens. Whereas on the Smart Pro, there can be changes made that are reflected within a 24 to 48 hour, hour period after they've been added due to the differences in the two programmers. Now, let's talk about this because most trained locksmiths should really know how to get the system into the on position when they're prompted. However, you do have some end users that are new to the game and they may not be that aware because with a regular keyed ignition, if you think about it, you're going from off to accessory to on. By turning it, it's, it's a little bit more natural for most end users as opposed to a proc system they may not be familiar with. With these proc systems, it's really imperative that you follow these screen prompts. In other words, you have to press that start stop button twice in order to get it to the on position. What happens a lot of times is someone will press it once, putting it into the accessory position, and they fail to press it that second time. That's what the Smart Pro message is all about. It's telling you, it's prompting you to press it a second time to get it into the on position. It even tells you to make sure to follow the instructions carefully, the procedure will fail. If you can make a mistake, you just can abort and start over again. So please make note of this, especially if you're an MVP or a T code owner, that in order to get these proc systems into the on position, you have to press that button not once, but twice. And that's my message today. It's all I have for you. And I hope you found it helpful. I look forward to seeing you in the next video. And thank you for watching.